Welcome to the Car Like I Don't See It podcast where we talk about movies, games, sports, and tears. I am GP. <laughs> what's up, everybody? Um, AD just said, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, AD. And um, AD, um, are you okay? Oh, you didn't get your uh, PS5 yet. Well, uh, me, me neither, man. Do you know when you're going to get it? Uh, okay, so you don't know. All right, man, we got to man up, man. We got to do this podcast, man. Man up. Wipe them tears off your face, man. Yeah, tears all over the mic, man. Come on. Toughen up. Man up. Man it up. <laughs> Sometimes you just got to laugh through the pain, you know what I mean? You just got to yeah. laugh. You got to laugh through the pain. Through the pain. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of which, that's a nice segue. Yep. Um... We've been asking this question all through the well, not all through the week, but you know, a few days now. And uh, what is your crying style? Yes, folks. Hold on, hold on. Okay. All right. Boogers. Emotional boogers out. Huh? Okay. Just had to clear that up. All right. <laughs> Ready to go. All, all right. right. Yes, what is your crying style? What is your folks? crying style? It's been an emotional week so for many. I know a lot of us share this pain. Yes. But uh, we wanted to know what your crying style is. So, mm-hmm. uh, GP and I have come up with a very funny categories here of different styles. We've named them. You named All right? Them. Good you names. might fall under this category. So, we want you to let us know what, if your category, if your category of uh, crying matches up with what we got, let us know. All right. At least uh, GP, some of these you probably done when you was a baby. At least. Yes. For, but for now, definitely for sure. But people's people's cries evolve over the years. You know, like oh, you yeah. don't just stick with the same cry. Like you no, cry no. by level thirty six. It's like a whole new level of crying. Mm-hmm. I'm not talking about age. I'm just talking about <laughs> just power level. <laughs> okay. You should you should say level level thirty six is age. That that was tight. Yeah, okay, all right. Level 36. Yeah. <laughs> By level 36, your cry is different. Mm-hmm. By level 80, you don't really cry. You just you just huff or whatever. Right. <laughs> you just huff. <laughs> all right, so uh let's go into let's go with the first cry style. All right. Uh cry style number one. G. Number one. Uh the Sanderish. The Sanderish. Explain to everybody. What's the Sanderish? The Sanderish <laughs> is <laughs> we got this because of a uh certain name we call a species that's in the uh, Star Wars universe. We don't They're, call it. Everybody should know who the sand people are. Yeah, yeah. They should know they, who they, they are. They should know who the sand people are, exactly. but you know, people that don't know, you know. They're they basically the ones with the mask on in the sand. And <laughs> yeah. Right so the Sanders is pretty much is similar to what I just opened up with. Yeah. Uh, basically, <laughs> co- complete gibberish. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You can't understand what the hell they say. Nothing. Not at all. <laughs> you don't know what they're talking about. Nothing. But somehow those loving mothers, they know just what those babies want. Exactly. <laughs> somehow, some way, moms speak well mm-hmm. in Sanderish. Yeah. <laughs> they they went to uh, school for it. Yeah, I don't got patience for that. If somebody come crying to me like that. I'm like, what? <laughs> say what you gotta say. What do you want? What do you want? Speak I'm English. actually, Speak I'm actually English. guilty of guilty of that as a father so far. <laughs> like, what, what is it? What is it? Say what you want. Say it. <laughs> Don't speak Sanders to me right now. <laughs> I don't understand. All right. Uh, <laughs> number two. What's number the number two? <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> the succubus. The succubus. The succubus. S U C K U P P A S. Yes. Spell it out. It's a real word. It's in Webster. Mm-hmm. All right. You know when you be succubus. sucking up air, sucking up air when you be trying yes. to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of those joints. Yes. The sucker buzz. <laughs> yes. So, are you a sucker buzz so far, or are you a Sanders? Let, Let us, us know. know. The list continues. Mm-hmm. Here we go. Number three, the undercovers. Right on. You know when you uh, you know you don't want nobody to see you cry. 
when you're crying a lot too and you know you mm-hmm. you do that cover arm over the eyes and you mm-hmm. show nothing but um elbows yeah that's the undercover you try to just keep it together keep as composed as you can yeah um even though you're a total wreck on the inside <laughs> you all you all messed up yeah. i give a lot of credit to those kind to that to this category though because they got they try to keep their keep that kind of like strength in check you know what i mean like right. i'm a t- i'm too tough to really like ball out but i'm i'm still okay enough to like cover it up here but see that there's, there's a problem with that one but because if you're crying for a long long time and you've been just covering your eyes for like at least uh-huh. about 10 minutes you open your eyes, man. It's light. You blind. Yeah, yeah. And it, you're full of mucus all over right. on your elbows, mm-hmm. on your forearm. Your Everything. forearm's full of slime. Yeah, and you're slimed up. You done. Which yeah. kind of moves into uh, <laughs> the, the next one. <laughs> uh, number four. This category is known as the Goop Droop. <laughs> this style. Ooh, the Goop Droop. The Goop Droopers. You Goop Droopers out there with lets out every liquid possible on your face. Just coming comes from your out. Ears, coming your from nose. Your ear. Ew, you, ew. Your, your eyebrows. Ears. You know. It is. I've never seen somebody had liquid on it. That's teeth. over the top. That is over the Everything top. Stop just it. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Ain't nobody crying no t- liquid <laughs> over the ears. <laughs> We're talking about the ones that hit like full mucus coming out, full tears out. You, you're probably drooling. You could be a drooler too. It's all the goop, all the goopiness that's in your face. It comes out. Yeah. All right. That's category, uh, category five. Right. Uh, category five. Uh, no, that was category four. Sorry. Category yeah. five. Uh, style number five. Okay, keep saying category. Style five. Yes. The, the cryo slumber. Right on. Yeah. You know when you just cry so much that you just pass out and fall asleep? <laughs> Kids do that all the time. They just... Yes. <laughs> do adults do that, though? Do, do adults still do that? Like, they cry themselves, like, instant sleep after? I think so. I think so. Cry fast sleep. Yeah. <laughs> they just get in the bed and just snuggle up. <laughs> Ten minutes of cry, instant sleep. Right. <laughs> Maybe that's some of the best ways to get sleep, too, is just cry yourself to sleep. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, we call it the cryo slumber. Right. And then uh, number six, G, let them know. This is the final six, one that we got. Final, final category that we got. <laughs> it's called the Miles. If you don't want to know who, what is the Miles, uh, let us explain. Um, the if you've seen Terminator <laughs> 2, Judgment Day. Terminator as, 2, Judgment Day. <laughs> as a character called Miles. He was an yes. inventor of the first Terminator. Mm-hmm. And um, there's a there's scene a in scene. the movie. Right. Yes. <laughs> where, where he's holding the, the detonator in his hand. <laughs> and he just <laughs> sitting there. <laughs> when he's, before he clicks out. <laughs> and then he's set it down in a big, huge explosion. <laughs> that's that, that's a type of cry. That is a type of cry. I, yes. I've actually seen people that do that. Like mm-hmm. that. That's the most annoying. I think that's annoying. The most right. annoying cry. It's like you're not really, you're not really fully gushing. You're just gasping. Right. You know, just instant like nonstop gaspage going on. I think the succubus <laughs> and the miles is. I think they're cousins. I don't know if I can stand seeing these any categories mixed here of these styles in like one sitting, like two people are crying and going at it and I'm just like oh my oh, god man. I'm losing my mind I'm losing my mind imagine imagine the succubus and the miles oh my god Go <laughs> and the sanderish oh Ooh, lord <laughs> next to him <laughs> suck on a lemon <laughs> all right yeah so once again those are the cry styles that we came up with and we yes. have labeled if you fit that cat one of those styles let us know if you have another one that we don't know about share all right it's okay to cry especially in this kind of day and age where you don't get ps5s on release day yeah it's okay to cry let it out mm-hmm. okay if you're tired of 2020 and just feel like crying cry, cry. Let it out let us know what's your cry style yeah <laughs> right so right. moving on that was a very a, bit, a little bit of a depressing way to start the show that was. <laughs> but we got some I'm, I'm pretty sure we got some good stuff later on yeah uh all right well, so call it take it away oh me right so in today's recent news Oh, God, this is gross. Ugh, this is gross. I'm already pissed already. All right, so Pizza Hut... <laughs> 
Pizza Hut added two new uh, two plant based items to their menu. Okay, mm-hmm. the pizza chain has partnered with Beyond Meat, which is beyond me. Why anybody would do this? It's freaking ridiculous. Uh, to launch two Beyond Pan pizzas, the Beyond Italian Sausage Pizza and the Great Beyond Pizza. If you're wondering why they keep calling it Beyond, folks, it's because they are using plant based meat. Mm-mm. It's a lie, and it's what they're selling, all right? The I don't announcement, trust this. <laughs> the announcement comes a day after McDonald's said it's created the McPlant, all right, which is a new plant based burger that restaurants around the world can start testing in 2021. Right. Pizza Hut's new items are available starting Tuesday. Uh, you guys can start ordering your Beyond Pan Pizza at Pizza Hut's uh, on Pizza Hut's original pan crust. I just don't like this idea I, I, at all. I don't like it at all either. I, I don't like. This. I don't like. I don't like. I don't like. They saying that this is plant based and where it could possibly be um, chewed up erasers being grind up into meat. <laughs> you don't know what that is. They could just. They I, could just call it whatever they want. It's oh, just you know, a it's bunch. Plants. It's just a like. But I mean, it is plants. Like I looked this thing up because I was like, you know, I'm like, come on, okay, what's really, what's really going on here? And they are using. Um, it's like they're, they're they're pulling stuff from like beans, right? Mm-hmm. Pulling certain oils to to create like a, a fake fat juice, right? You can uh, all the plants, man. And and it actually they, like these these plant based meats actually bleed like it's real meat, yeah. Um, which is disgusting because I'm like, what is it bleeding if it's Green, not blood? Poop. You know. So yeah, I don't know. I don't like being lied to, and that's every like this is this is disgusting to me like you would have i understand okay yeah we need to change up you know make things a bit more uh sustainable here in terms of resources and cleaner mm-hmm. for health right you know everybody wants to be healthy um everybody well just don't eat the meat don't eat the meat don't try to fake and and, and lie like you eat your meat don't yeah, do better, it better yet just eat the toppings just eat those just, plant-based toppings Call, yeah don't, just, even, just don't put, even mess with the bread just eat onions, mushrooms, and tomatoes on your yeah. pizza. Don't, yeah, don't try to. Oh, we're, we're eating meat, but it's not really meat. Like, like, you know how stupid that looks. <laughs> that's what I don't get. Now the toppings. Some of these toppings don't even have um, veggies. You know, it's, it's veggies mm. basically. They don't right. have the use of being a plant based because it's coming from a plant already. Right. So, what besides meat is the toppings? You said right. Right, it's just the toppings, but like it's the Italian sausage is not really sausage, not really meat. It's it's plant, it's plant based stuff that they turn into the meat. Yeah. But but they call it it sausage, you know. Mm. Like if an apple is an apple, it's a damn apple. If it's not really meat, don't put the meat label on it. Like right. <laughs> why? Why still do it? Right. What part of your conscience still needs to know? Like oh, I'm eating meat. You know, you try to psych yourself out. Mm-hmm. Like why don't you just eat cardboard and call it meat? <laughs> just oh, I'm eating plant-based pizza. It's just really cardboard with sauce. Just, just, just put some wood chips, <laughs> wood chips, <laughs> wood chips on that pizza. And call it around. There you go. That, that looks like doesn't that look like sausage? Right. Mm. Dice it up real nice. Dice up your wood really nicely. Wait, no, not, that, that, that's coming off kind of. Nice weird. Up. <laughs> whoa, whoa, that's, whoa! That's coming off. This is a PG weird. show, man. <laughs> Dice up the uh, <laughs> plant-based wood, geez, plant-based wood. <laughs> <laughs> Put the plant-based wood on your pizza and eat that. <laughs> um, <laughs> Look, it still sounds funny. It still does. It does, doesn't it? I'm yeah. sorry. Wood. <laughs> wood. But yeah, I don't know. Like it's it, it it just rubs me wrong when it's like, okay, just don't ha- don't try to put something and and as a substitute. Just just knock it out altogether. Don't worry about putting it on your pizza just or no anything. Toppings. Do no toppings. Call it like right. the Impossible Burger. I like. <laughs> What? You're taking out the whole joy and fun of a burger. Yeah. And plus, You're supposed to feel guilty after eating it. Not not guilty. And plus, man, those <laughs> those Beyond Burgers and stuff, man, they got so much saturated salt just to make a flavor. <laughs> just to make... Why go through all that trouble just to make it uh, what's already out there? Like, yeah. go through all that science and stuff just to make what's already there. Like, right. nobody's traveling to space. If, is everybody traveling to space? Right. Is that why you need this this kind of meat, this kind of false meat? If you were, you know, because in space, there's no cows. So, okay, I can understand you need this space meat. I'm going to call it space meat. That's what it is. This Man. is space meat to me. Man, they, they, they suck on um, paste up there in space, so they don't even need that. 
But I mean, if they if they did need like a, a Whopper or, or uh, uh, some pizza of some kind with meat on it, I can understand why they use this beyond meat. But this is beyond my uh, comprehension here. I don't want it. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. Me neither, man. If, if you're into that, if you want to be... And, but then the next thing too, like cause and effect, right? People start eating this, you know, like hybrid cars, right? They start shoving it into your face, being all smug about it. Oh, yeah. you drive one of those regular cars? <laughs> oh, you eat regular pizza with the nasty sausage on your burger? <laughs> <laughs> you like, eat pepperoni. <laughs> you eat Italian sausage? <laughs> like, why don't you eat, like, you know, plant-based stuff? You moron. <laughs> you know what kind of health problems you're going to have in the near future? Do you know Stop. what this looks like in your colon? <laughs> like, get the hell. Let Look me enjoy this. my stuff. Look at this documentary on how <laughs> and why. Because you pizza. know, you know there's a category of people that's going to be out there that's being all smug about it. Like, yeah. those Starbucks, you know, oh, you get, you make your coffee? <laughs> like, <laughs> no, I buy mine. Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> I go to Starbucks. <laughs> I don't do meat. Like, I do my plant-based stuff. It's trendy. It's so trendy. <laughs> trendy plant-based. <laughs> you know what healthy also? Growing little, growing fruit and vegetables in your backyard. Cutting exactly. it up. Making a pizza. Exactly. <laughs> Making a pizza. Throw some sausage on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Gross. Is this plant-based? Oh, I cannot even. Is this a plant-based party? I'm not here. I can't be invited. <laughs> <laughs> what soil did that plant grow from? Ew, everything, everything just everything just changes from that afterwards. Is this a plant-based show that I'm listening to on this podcast? It's not. I can't listen. Is this plant <laughs> plant-based sounds coming out of your speakers? Oh my god, is this plant-based? Are your oh, speakers no. Plant based? Is this toilet paper plant based? Is it? <laughs> I oh I don't wipe my butt with plant based nothing that's not plant based. I'm sorry. I am so sorry. Okay. <laughs> Are your appetizers plant based? <laughs> Get the hell out of the restaurant. Get out. <laughs> we did that <laughs> we did that on purpose. No, we had to do it like that on purpose to rub people off of this stupid plant based idea. Oh, Jeez. If you haven't realized by now we don't like it. No, we don't like it. <laughs> No, we don't. Let's yeah. call it right to the death. Call it. Are you well, serious? Are you, is this a plant based? Call it? Because if it's not, <laughs> if it's not plant based, I don't want to call it. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> All right, next one. Next topic, oh, G. This, Take it away. What we got? Is, to do this today? one is a more light, light based. Uh, <laughs> I yeah, story. I don't know if you want to use the word light. Here, not G. light, but it's funny. It it's funny. It's Go hilarious. ahead. Go ahead. Um, <laughs> <laughs> a school had to tell parents to stop tossing late students over their fences while they're closed. <laughs> yes, you heard that right. Parents Which, was tossing their kids over the fence mm. because they were late. Which, which closed? area? Which area is it? <laughs> France. 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 It's an elementary France. school at that. Mm -hmm. So that's a uh, is it? They they had to do uh, <laughs> you know how they have those wanted po posters. They mm -hmm. got like a drawing of a parent throwing a kid. <laughs> tossing. I <laughs> saw the picture, dude. Yeah, tossing the kid over the fence. Yeah, so they got they got posters <laughs> all on the front of the gate. <laughs> Warning stop parents to stop doing that. And is this this is one school, right? Is that like a is that nah, like a nah, district nah. of it's schools just, in France? It's just, it's just one school. I want to go to this school in France just to see, like, yeah, I need too. to get an exact location. Yeah, I that is so take a selfie freaking right hilarious. Now. Yeah. Allez vous, allez vous. <laughs> Bunch of parents throwing their kids over the fence because they don't want to pay for daycare. I'm not staying home today. I uh, know nah, you, but you, but you go to work. You go to school. <laughs> Kid, like, Dad, the, the the gate closed. No worry, son. No when I toss you over. Get ready to tuck and roll. Ready? Tuck and roll. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> Hold on to your baguettes. Hold on to your baguettes. You're going over. <laughs> so you can imagine the French teachers. Where is Francois? <laughs> oh, he's late. He comes crashing through the window. He's he just got he just got thrown. Oh, he's late. <laughs> he just got thrown into the window. Oh, <laughs> he has his car speeding off. Bonjour, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> 
Dad, <laughs> Pert- you said Pert- Dad, like, Dad's uh, uh, drive off. <laughs> just speed it off. Principal had enough of it. It's like, how many, why, how many son? average? <laughs> that's the 20th kid this week that's been thrown over the fence. Right. Oh, my God. Because they don't want to avoid being uh, <laughs> stuck at home with their, with their kids. Man, imagine that oh parent teacher God. meeting conference. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Your kid would do a lot better if he's here on time and yes. not being thrown over the fence yeah. and hurting himself. Now, when he when he come in, he has a concussion and he can't even yeah, stay he, awake. He can't even focus. Yeah. Right? He, he's all bruised up. Right. I'm like, how, how as a parent, you find it like the strength in the morning to throw your kid over? I mean, exactly. I, I got to see what kind of fences they throw it over. Cause that's Starbucks. Like, Starbucks coffee. <laughs> and they bring the kids to school and then they toss them. Right. Toss them over. Oh my god. I wonder how like how that looks. If they're curled up, they really have like a certain position. <laughs> the drive by drive by tossings. <laughs> Here's your croissant. Take your croissant. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. <laughs> 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 And it's like you, you and your friends too. Like it's like four of them that come in late every day. Yeah. And you seeing a couple of them being tossed at the same time. <laughs> they, got, <laughs> they got twigs and stuff all in, in their collar, bro. <laughs> collar and all that. Uh, they come to class pulling out yeah. bungees and stuff from being tossed. Over. <laughs> they're they're limping. Yeah. Bonjour, bonjour, bonjour. No. <laughs> I got oh, to sit man. down. <laughs> <laughs> got to recover. There's 20 minutes is to recover from being tossed. Yeah. Wow, but yeah, as a teacher, I'd I'd laugh. I just I'd, I'd note the, the the students is gonna be late every day just to, yeah. to look out the window when they're gonna get tossed over. <laughs> like, oh, there he is, there he is. <laughs> nice. I give that toss a ten. <laughs> Imagine that that teacher uh, saying, "Where's Francis? Francis, <laughs> come through the crash it right through the window." Oh yeah, <laughs> I, I made it. Am I early? Uh, no. no, no, you are late. No, you're late. But the fact that they have to to send out a warning to parents to not throw their kids over—that's the hilarious part. Like, yeah. as a parent, I I don't know. I don't find I don't wouldn't find the the courage in being a parent to throw my son over a fence to be on time for school. I we're want, late. They close the doors. Just go home. I wonder how tall is that gate? Is it six feet? Twelve feet? <laughs> exactly. Like you got if it if it's one of those tall games, I'm like, yeah, you must you must be serious about getting your child to school. Right. I like the effort. I mean we could give them an effort for still wanting their child to get yeah. an education, but at what cost, dang it? Yeah. At what cost? That's a workout right there. <laughs> serious workout. Hurts the kid's soul. Mm-hmm. I can't keep getting tossed today, Daddy. That's the fourth time this week. Daddy, my shoulder yeah. dislocated five times this week. <laughs> well, pop it back in, because I'm not... T- <laughs> I ain't calling your auntie to come babysit you today. Nope. <laughs> she said no anyway. They need to bring that thing over here. Over- <laughs> All right. Bunch of kids getting tossed in. Yeah. Hey, Trey! Boy, get your butt over here. Come here. You get tossed. <laughs> Parents here be like, man, you better go up there and finish yourself. I'll help you, but I ain't tossing you up there. I ain't. <laughs> <laughs> Working my back out. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, so that's the silly. That's the one silly report. That was the yeah. other silly one we got. Uh, yeah. yeah. All right. So that's it. We could call it on the French uh, parents. Yep. Call it right in and now. Tossing well, their call kids. It call it. Then. Is that a plant based sauce? I don't know. I don't want to see it. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what is this fence made of? Plants? Fence? Plant space? Let me know. <laughs> She will be coming back, I feel like, <laughs> for oh, the yeah. rest of this episode. Probably so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got quick nips. Oh, 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 Yes, All right, yes. that was pretty good. All right, All right. this week at Quick Miss G, take it away. Who we got first? All right, Spyglass Media Group is set to remake the 1986 film Short Circuit. Short Circuit, getting a remake. Yes. Why? How do you feel about that? I don't. I don't like it, man. You don't want to see number Johnny Five again? Nah, 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 not really. Well, the first not? one was fine, and that's about it. The second one, Wait. I was like, uh-uh. I'm about what to say, wasn't it? Wasn't there a short circuit too? Yeah, where he turned gold at the end, and he. <laughs> oh man, how you did not like that though? That's the only part I like. He, he was gold <laughs> when he told when he turned gold at the end. That's about it. He, that, I, I didn't like the second one really. If the remake is gonna have like. Number Johnny Five just gold from the get go. I will watch. <laughs> yeah. I will watch. I'll tell you, we gotta watch and we're gonna review it on this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Number Johnny yes. Five, I'm balling. I'm balling. <laughs> balling, sucker. <laughs> 
All right, next quick bake. <laughs> yeah, next quick bake. Next quick bake. Darkwing Duck is also getting. What is with all these dang reboots? reboots Darkwing man. Duck is now getting a reboot. Um, Seth Rogen sent to helmet with another guy. Mm -hmm. um, it's supposed to be on nowhere. No, where else? Disney Plus. Disney Plus. Taking more of your money. Darkwing right. Duck. Uh, oh wow! Nice. Called DW. Uh, Darkwing Duck. 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 Yes. Yeah, get get dang dangerous. dangerous. Oh, I didn't know he was gonna drop the uh, the song here. I was like, I was like oh, snap. You got excited. Huh? Oh, let me pull on my pull on my tie dye shirt real quick. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> let me get my fade out, bro. Let me get my fade on. <laughs> Let's get dangerous. <laughs> With my air pump max. <laughs> oh, oh man. Crack with Doc. <laughs> with, with crack. Oh, I forgot his name. Where's my trapper keeper? I can't wait. <laughs> for this throwback I'm joking yeah. I don't know yeah. but yeah we'll see they yeah. rebooted everything le lately because like I said and this has to be a discussion of all these old cartoons just being the best that cartoons could go yes. like with the, that was the pinnacle of cartoons back then yep um, so yeah Dark Duck getting a reboot next time uh, quick bit Woo! yep um, Chris Pratt joins the cast of Thor L Love and Thunder are and you mocking me <laughs> He's oh, trying damn. to copy me. <laughs> trying to copy me. <laughs> this is my ship. <laughs> <laughs> Filming starts um, in January in Australia. January, sorry? Yep, in Australia. All right. Well, it makes sense because they kind of like, then they last link off with, with Thor being there on his ship. Yeah, they have right? to, man. They have to. So they're kind of like trading movies because Thor's going to be in uh, God of uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. Um, so I guess they're going to trade in this one then for Chris Pratt to be in Thor. Right. Which is great. I, I pretty much think like all these movies from Marvel now is just going to have somebody linked from their universe tagging up. Nobody's going to have like a strict solo movie. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's the universe yeah. too big now. Too big now. Everything's all out. Uh, speaking of which, next quick bit. Next quick bit, AD. All right. Next quick bit, WandaVision. Uh, they just did show their little teaser trailer, I guess. Whatever you want to call it. Uh, they're coming out. They're dropping on January 15th. So if you've been waiting for WandaVision, um, look out for it January 15th. If you make it to 2021, that is. <laughs> right around the corner. Yeah. <laughs> Hold survive. on. Survive. Survive if you want to see what happens to Vision and Wanda, even though they were, uh, Vision was dead. Mm -hmm. Did he come back? No. No, so I don't know where this is really going to be. It's impossible for him to come back. He's not human. It's not impossible, okay? It's plant-based. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Possible burger. <laughs> there she is. She's back again. All right. Next, ne <laughs> next one. <laughs> Netflix renews Umbrella Academy for season three. And season filming three. starts in February 2021. 2021. Season three started up. Awesome. I wish it would just drop, but I guess, you know, things got to get filmed and take time, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So, yeah. All right. Yeah. That is that is that. Mm -hmm. All right. Quick bits. Quick bits. Woo! Quick bits. <laughs> that was quick bits. I'm really trying to recover still from crying so much. My, my <laughs> ears, everything's like clogged up. <laughs> this is going to be okay, my, man. This my sinuses okay. are all out of whack right now, folks. <laughs> Extra sniffy. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. Um, um, you want to bring this in or you want me to bring it in? I guess I bring it in. Yeah, 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 you bring it in. All right, so, uh, folks, um, we, we do this every now and then on the show. Uh, you guys know we have this segment called I Can't Believe I Just Watch, where you sit through something and it just pains you to get through it. It's either, It could be either 30 minutes, an hour, two hours, a movie, a show, a game. It could be even a game. Like yeah. a sports game. Like, damn, I can't mm -hmm. believe I watched the NBA finals. Like, that was a waste of my time. Um, so yeah, this week I can't believe I just watched. <laughs> we have, and this is painful, folks. This one's pretty painful. Ooh. The uh that latest the the, re <laughs> the remake of Ooh. cats. The remake of Cat. So if uh, I'll, I'll just give you guys a little uh, backstory here before uh, G has a lot to say on this. Um, so Cats, the original musical that was based on Broadway, um, was a very uh, successful musical, right? On stage, on stage, <laughs> not a movie. Broadway. Um, it, t it dealt with all these cats pretty much meeting up. Um, they're called Jellico Cats, and they, um, they there's this one. Jellico Goose, Jellico Goose, and Jellico Sea. 
And, then, <laughs> and there's one old cat that makes his choice uh, of who's which cat's gonna get reborn, which given a new life, sort of like Cat Heaven. All right. So throughout the whole musical, there's different cats that that they have to sing their number, um, and like you know, just say a bit about themselves through music. Uh, and then at the end, they pick whoever is gonna be the uh, Jellical chosen. This, so <laughs> this don't make no sense. <laughs> well, so, well, all the people so in this city. First, this off. remake is what we're, we're what we're gonna be crapping on not the original cats musical it's the remake that it's we're the joking. remake but and g give your take okay for uh, like uh, it's the it's the remake but the broadway was uh, if it's like that then i'm like what is this <laughs> what, what 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 was i looking at that's the, the question but I look wanted musicals go. musicals aren't for everyone all right no they, no no they, they, they aren't wrong. for me nothing's wrong with a musical that makes sense mm-hmm. This, okay. This here <laughs> don't make no sense. <laughs> no sense. No sense. Okay. Just the plot alone just don't make any sense. I have a question. Uh huh. Okay. It's when they choose a cat and get reborn. Where's a where does that cat go? They go to cat heaven. It, it so, uh. So basically the heavy side layer. Basically, <laughs> this is. A town of regular people, and they sacrifice one person. Pretty much, but it's not <laughs> like it's from the world. It's from the world of like it's it's like regular cats that's going around, right? It's there's humans, of course, they exist, but they're talking about just like if you were in the cat world. So they sacrificing one cat. I don't know if it's a sacrifice. It's a sacrifice, Ad. <laughs> they go into heaven. They go into cat a, heaven. They die. It's a musical <laughs> sacrifice. Gee, it's not. It's a musical it's, sacrifice. They won't be. Uh-huh. Okay, I'm. I'm, I'm so, okay, go. so okay, so the plot you didn't you didn't quite understand. What else? No. What else did you not enjoy about <sighs> this remake? Hollywood dares to spend. <laughs> <laughs> however how many hundreds of millions of dollars right Mm -hmm. to place the wackest unused CGI oh my god on people jeez what you beat me to it you beat me to it the Jellicoe <laughs> what the jellicle? What the jellicle? <laughs> what the jellicle? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> is that jellicle based? Is plant that based? jellicle? <laughs> Are you jellicle or plant based? I don't oh, know. Man. Wow. I yeah, the, CG- it, Dude, the CGI that- was horrible. They could have just put them in cat suits like a I- musical. I. That's what. Okay. Can I give a little bit of my take here on this? Go ahead. That's my first thing that pissed me off from the jump, because I originally like it took me a while to eventually warm up to the original Cats musical, right? Because my mom used to play that thing like nonstop, like every <laughs> chance she got. So you'd be forced to watch it, but then eventually you understood the art behind it and the right. music, what, right? What so was, I was like, what was your favorite song? Um. Oh man, from the original. Yeah. The original Cats, uh, I gotta say Memory. Memory is one of my f- favorite songs, right? Um, the, that's like the main number at the end. That the um, the one that gets chosen, that's the one that she sings. You talking about what um, she's saying? Um, uh, Daylight, turn your pants uh, to the oh. moon. Oh, okay. I can smile at the old gate. <laughs> 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 but yeah, that was one of my favorite ones. And there's a few more, but... okay. Even, but from the, from, so yeah, I eventually developed a, a, a appreciation for that original, right? So mm-hmm. I was like, you know, let me, when we, when we, when you said we were watching this, I already heard how bad this review, these reviews were about the remake. Yeah. I did so yeah. we, we, we jumped in and folks, we literally, it was a pain to sit through this damn movie. Man, we, we didn't watch it all. We didn't really watch the whole. I stopped with what thirty five minutes left in the movie. I stopped. Yeah, I, stopped. I never stop at a movie. I stopped I and watched it later, and I skimmed through that part. I never do that. So that's to tell you how bad this movie was. Firstly, like we were talking about the CGI. As soon as the first cat shows up, I was like, Lord have mercy! Whoa, <laughs> what the? Is this PS two graphics or is this PS one? <laughs> I know we have advanced in CGI to, enough to, to give us something better than that because that was horrible, man. They couldn't use actual... Why didn't they use real cats? I don't know. Be, like, the faces... CGI did real not, cats. The faces did not look well on these people. Like, 
it did not look well. That was my first thing with it. The second thing that I that that rubbed me wrong was how they butchered the songs. They so, so butchered, that's what I was about to ask you. Some uh-huh. of these songs are new, or is all the same? Some mostly all of them were the same. Okay. But they butchered the crap out of them. Like they butchered, like they spent some of them were way too fast right. from what the original was, and then some of it, like the emphasis on certain uh, tones and 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 how you're supposed to, um, you know, say it, it. They just they just messed that whole part up. Yeah. Um, so I was just like, what the hell? You missing out main parts of like the the base behind some of these characters. Mm-hmm. So that rubbed me wrong. I was just like, man, Lord have mercy. And then the part that just threw me off and I was like, I'm gone. <laughs> what freaking uh Idris Elba. I is it Idris or El, El, Idris? How do you say his uh, name? Idris. Idris. Okay. Idris Elba. Yeah. When this dude took off his coat. <laughs> <laughs> this dude, <laughs> <laughs> This dude, like, he got a condition. I can't explain. I don't know. First off, first of all, first off, most of these characters look weird as cats. From Judy Dench to to James Corden to Itris Elba. The only Jason Doc Got Dog Derulo. <sighs> Boy. But when Idris took off his coat, I said, oh, God, dogs, I am God. That looks so awkward. It looked so yeah, awkward and it horrendous. Did. It was it just, did, it was just the pinnacle it of did. the movie. And how this dude had, I, like, I, looked like he had a cat body. It, like it everybody had, <laughs> was in a suit. <laughs> it CGI so, crap. <laughs> but even like his, <laughs> like they, <laughs> they emasculated his. They shaved his, his wood off. They shaved <laughs> his wood off. <laughs> <laughs> I said, oh Lord, he got really, he got nude in here. <laughs> <laughs> they literally really uh, did cut off that ball, that Idris's wood right there. They cut yeah. it, they cut it off. He, was in the, he went to the vet. I, I was they, like, they, why did you yeah, take your coat off? off? You yeah. were looking cool before with the hat and the, and the coat. And you took he it off. Never, I was like, he should have never took oh, that coat Lord. off. He took it off to dance. Like, he was feeling himself a little too much. <laughs> I said, I'm going. I clicked it off and I, really, I texted him. I texted you. I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm out. I'm done. I can't but watch dude, this. Speaking of that, some of these cats have uh, like <laughs> fur where they can take the fur off to show clothes. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't understand the gist of the coat because the coat, like if they have a coat already, why have another coat on? You know, exactly. like some of them. But OK, the only cat that did look sort of like OK was, um, believe it or not, Gandalf. Right. No, not Gandalf. What am I? I'm sorry. Not Gandalf. Uh, uh, Ian McKellen. Yes. Oh, dang, I messed up on that one. Was it Gandalf? Yeah, he's Gandalf. Yeah, it is Gandalf. Lord yeah, of Rings. Yeah. I didn't mess up. All right, yeah, Gandalf. His his cat actually was like, okay, that was the best decent looking cat, mm-hmm. you know, because he had a, he looked old and the cat looked old and it, it matched up well. So that's the one bright spot that I saw in the movie. I ain't seen no bright spots, man. These songs was so annoying. <laughs> hey, These songs were so annoying. Yo, he messed up that song so bad. Oh my Dude. god. The oh, where the castle that was in the <laughs> magic. Oh my god. Was and then awful. the part that seemed the most awkward was when they had like the uh the it looked like a cat orgy. Did you see that? It looked like a cat orgy. The whole, the was... whole movie looked like a cat orgy. What <laughs> oh, a cat so clever then. When they were all in the in the ball and they, like they all started twitching. Um, and then oh, some with of the them tails go up. Yeah, oh some God, of them man. were breathing hard. Like I was like, y'all having a cat orgy? Or is this just me? <laughs> they was, they I need was, to go. They were sniffing that catnip. That was. Good, I need bro. to go. I need to go. I need to go. This, I'm not feeling comfortable. I did not feel comfortable watching oh, that scene. <laughs> I got so clever than ever. <laughs> you sound like you fit right in, G. You should probably go be a cat. Dude, man. man. <laughs> Yo, wear your coat. <laughs> Don't All take I your coat off. I keep hearing those songs, man. Oh, like, oh my God. That's <laughs> a jellico B. Jellico use and jellico C. It's a category. It's a specific type of cat named Jellicles. Oh. It's funny. It's supposed to be interesting and, and creative. Man, this is weird. <laughs> It, no, this movie made it weirder than it should have been. The original musical was acceptable, right? Because you knew there were people just wearing cat suits. Mm. Okay, it was easy to grasp. Mm. This was just like god awful. 
Yeah. Just god awful. Yeah, I, I I gave it I gave it a solid two. It's a serious two out of ten. Damn, I give that a one. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, good thing they didn't put you in no cat suit. Yeah, don't put me in no cat suit. I don't want you anyway. I don't want to be no CGI. They put, no they turn cat, nah, cat, you need to go with dogs. They got that dogs movie yeah. next door. Oh. DMX, baby. Rough, rough. Jellicles, Jellicle me. Jellicle. They got dogs chewing in the next production room. Snoop Dogg. DMX. Oh, my God. Yes, yeah, so folks. That movie was horrible, and it deserved all the crap that it got for it because they they just messed it up. Yeah. And I was actually I was actually super uh, interested when it first I first saw that trailer because I was like, oh snap, you know? Because like I said, my mom was really into it, so I was like, it'll just be a good treat. And then once I saw that it, it was butchered and stuff, I was like, mm, nah, I'm not gonna take, I'm not gonna waste my money, you know. So, but I, I still didn't see it until last night, and I was like, God damn, man, that movie was a pain. It was, it was hurtful. Like <laughs> I, I'm glad we, because folks, we were watching it, and then I was like, you know. I'm glad we have we're playing Ghost of Leg- uh, Ghost of Tsushima after this. We literally we stopped playing, stopped to, watching. To we had to save game. the Saturday, man. The, the, we had to save our Saturday night because <sighs> this thing was ruining it. I was like, damn, I, I've already wasted 40 minutes of that. I can't get back. This is bad. This is bad. Abort. This definitely. I, I needed something cats. to pull me away. I needed something to pull me away. Cats. Plant based. This was. This was <laughs> yeah. Beyond cats. This is beyond cats. Beyond cats. Yes. So uh, yeah, call it. We we call you want to call it on cats. Let's call it. Can't believe I just watched cats. Don't go and watch it. You'll save yourself a lot of pain. Call it. And, call and it. Naked well, call it thing. <laughs> 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 it's Jellico, man. It's, it's good. Man. It's Jellico. Are you silly? <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you want to get a Jellico cat? <laughs> <laughs> this make me don't want to even want to look at a cat. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna kick, kick a cat for no reason? <laughs> like, get out of here! <laughs> they made a movie after you, hey, Jellico. <laughs> get out of here! <laughs> Goddamn Jellicles! All right, uh, <laughs> yeah, all right, right there, moving on, on, moving on. GP, you got a review on yes. uh, your game that you've been playing recently. I have yes. not got into this, so this is all you. Take it away. Mm-hmm. Um. The game is called Watch Dogs Legion. This is the third installment of a series. And, um... It's th- this is the third one, you said? Yeah, it's third Damn. one. Damn. This is the third one. Yep. I thought it was only one other one. All right. Yeah. Um, the first game was mainly uh, about one protagonist. The second and, the, and this one is, like, a group called Densec. Uh-huh. And it focuses on a hacker group as they seek to clear their names for a series of bombings that impacted the city as well as liberating its citizens from its surveillance state by a oppressive private military company. So basically, DedSec is a group of hackers, right? So the game's all about hacking. All about hacking. You can hack from any any machinery from cars to Mm -hmm. um drones okay anything anything you need to to, to have finish the technology. mission uh-huh. yeah you, you can you can uh look at people profiles from your phone and connect so to their phone all that is it uh is it role playing is it like is it a shooter yeah it's a it's a shooter like an action game okay first yeah. person third person uh third 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 person. Person. Yeah. All right, cool. Mm-hmm. So in this game, you can cr- recruit anyone off the street, main basically. Uh huh. Anyone off the street. Say, think of this as a well, Grand Theft Auto hacking game. I was about to say that. It's not like Grand Theft Auto, but you yeah. you you like doing it gangster with some hackers. Right. You can you can you can you can you can change clothes. This is in London, by the way. Okay, it's all beats It's a little London. futuristic London. That's because London's just, full of hackers. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, so th- the difference of this game is, like I said, you can you can recruit anyone who has a particular skill. Say you see a nurse, right? You can use, mm-hmm. you can try to recruit her a part of your team and use mm-hmm. her skills 
in a mission. So you're recruiting regularly, right? You're not hacking people. You're recruiting people. It's a little bit of both. Okay. You got to you gotta hack her information to see who she is and her skill. Oh, I got you. Yeah. I got you. I got you. Wow. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So what's the who's the is there like a main villain that you got to take down or it's a it's a so far I I haven't finished the game so Uh it's a secret organization that okay that basically um framed DedSec which is the group okay and for 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 these bombings so you got to clear your your name at the same time figure out who is this uh secret organization okay cool yeah all right, sounds interesting. What do you give it out of what? What do you What are you rating it so far as you play? I'm rating it a eight. So far. an eight. Yeah. Uh, so far. So far. Okay. Yeah. Because are, are you still like in the beginning parts or the middle? I'm towards the middle. Towards the middle. All right. Yeah, cool. Because I've been playing, you know, Ghost and you know. Of course, you gotta yeah. spend your time. You gotta spend your time wisely. Yeah. yeah um. Yeah. Are there anything plant based in this game? Like, <laughs> can I like buy it but not really play it? <laughs> you know? Can I hack but not really call it hacking? You know? <laughs> can I? Is, plant? Is, like a, <laughs> is it a plant based virus or or is it just a regular virus? Because <laughs> I don't want to play this game. <laughs> <laughs> There's cats in it. Ooh. Jellico cats and Jellico. Cat cat face. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> well, yeah. All right, cool. So, um, anything else you want to add on that? Uh, or... Yeah. Uh, there's an option of permanent death in this game. Okay. Permanent death means like, um, like say you have a character that you developed and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. And since you can recruit however many people you want, Mm-hmm. If that one character dies in the game, uh-huh. that's it for that character. Oh wow! So they actually die. Yeah, but you have to choose permanent death in the beginning of the game. Okay. To do that, I think you could. Oh, that's, in the that's game, pretty realistic. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, yeah. you get you get killed, you're dead. That's it. That's, yeah, that's it. it. That's it. That's all. That's it. It's the closest thing to reality in the video game, right? Yeah. Here. But think of a awesome. character with a lot of skills, man, and he just died. If you if you. Uh, so it's so, permanent death mode. So it kind of gives you a reason to like protect them or like look out for them more. Yeah, or be right? mindful and skill skill in okay. to your missions and don't die. Okay. Be oh, careful. all right. Be careful. Don't die or be it'll be real life. It'll yeah. be permanent permanent death where you you the player actually are linked to the character exactly. and if that character dies, you're actually dead. <laughs> you're, uh, uh, That's when they take gaming too far. I know, right? <laughs> they hack life. <laughs> Watchdogs, real life. <laughs> that's, that's a Ready Player One. That bomb. <laughs> oh yeah, 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 yeah. Nice, dope. All right. Uh, so you call it that? Give call it a right eight out of ten. ten. We'll yep. call eight. it Watchdogs ten. Legions, folks. If you went to it, to it get on to it. Play it. Okay. If you already got your PS5, you still play it. <laughs> enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> but, Man. Oh, we gonna God. get one soon, man. We gonna get one soon. Let's not bring this up right now. We still got a few more things to get through. <laughs> yeah, Don't yeah, yeah. Go Don't cry. Don't start crying, please. All right. In other awesomeness, we got the uh, latest episode of Mandalorian that just dropped and just came out, um, which is pretty cool. Episode eleven. What was the title again, G? The Harris. The Harris. The Harris. The Harris. The Harris. The Harris. Harris. Yes. <laughs> the Harris. Yes. Uh, what do you think, man? Now, uh, what you thought? I thought it was it was dope, man. Yeah, I like the fact that they was on a a planet with water. <laughs> yeah, barely you see Star Wars films with water in them, so mm-hmm. like a big wait, wait. body of water. But the whole planet was water, mainly. Yeah, most of it. And it, so, what was it? What, oh, they were, the man, they were like that, on a that, station. Uh, the uh, moon of Trask. Uh huh. Yeah, that's the name of the planet. Okay. Yeah. So they were on like some kind of like built station then. Yeah, it was like that's it's like it. a like a. Um, Little like a, port. Like a, yeah, like an oil rig type of. Oh, okay. Oil rig yeah. setup. Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah, that was dope. That was mm-hmm. the, the adventure part of these these uh, episodes so far is really good, man. Like, they're really taking you out to all these different spots that's like haven't been touched before and mm-hmm. outside of Tatooine because everybody doesn't have like 16 parties on that damn planet. Yeah. But, um,. But yeah, th- this one, this one was pretty adventurous. The action, action in this episode was great. Yeah. Oh, spoiler alert! Ah, oh, spoiler alert! Ah, <laughs> spoiler, ah, spoiler alert! Oh god, I was about to alert. say something too. Yeah. <laughs> spoiler alert! Yes, yeah, spoiler yeah. because um, who's that character that popped up? The chick. 
She was in um, the Clone Attack. Wars or, Clone Wars? or Rebels, one of the two. Ah, uh-huh. it was one of the animated Maybe. shows. Yeah, but she the right. voice she did the voice, so she 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 came back as the live action version of it. Oh, I see. Which I didn't, is cause, tight because mm-hmm. they you know they gluing it all together. So basically, right. So she they linked is the character. So they link. Are they linking all of the stuff from Clone Wars now into this show? From Clone Wars and Rebels, they they linking all that to into. Wow, because I've never watched universe. I've never watched Rebels or Clone Wars, so all this yeah, stuff comes hella fresh to me. Yeah. I was just yeah. like, oh snap, who's this? Oh, she seems pretty awesome. But damn, mm-hmm. that cool music they were playing when they were shooting all them uh, squid looking people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, that squid guy voice had me cracking up, bro. <laughs> like <laughs> he didn't even look like his mouth was moving, and he, he just. So <laughs> Hey, you looking for some good to do it? <laughs> I got you over here. I got you over here. Come on over here. Let's go. <laughs> then he's just, I'm going to push you up, baby. <laughs> I'm going to push you in that water. <laughs> Come on over here. Look at this. Restored. <laughs> Restored. <laughs> I like, damn, dude, you couldn't look any more sus. <laughs> yeah. And for Mando, I'm like, dude, come on. You can't just be going around trusting everybody that you run into because right. they keep... They, they, you were going, they all after, they all know about your deal with this little baby Yoda. So right. you, 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 you literally walking with baby Yoda all around. Yeah. They it's got like people, last... in, people in coats looking at you from a distance. Exactly. Oh, right. Everybody knows what your mission is. Um, so yeah, he should probably just chill out with beating everybody and just be like, hey, how are you guys doing? Yeah. Um, so yeah, but dope, dope action, man. That, like the way he was taking yeah. down that, the, uh, the spacecraft. Yeah. And then the dude, um, the chick mentioned the black saber again. Right. You know, you know that black saber is the, is the is the real deal. That is the um, original. You know, I like the fact that they had um, old Mandalorians and like new Mandalorians where they don't follow the exact rules as the yeah. old ones. Yeah, so. she hit him hard with that. This is the way line, though. Yeah. I was like, right. oh, she got she you. Was like, dang, this is the way. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> <laughs> dang. He's like, you, but you change the terms. <laughs> well, this is the way, sucker. Ah, she got me. This is the oh, she and then she walk off all balls. Like, he's like, you know what? If I wasn't stuck in this helmet, I'll take you right now. Yeah. <laughs> I also like the fact that they using they using their jetpacks a whole bunch. They using their jetpacks so much. Yeah, in they these are episodes, man. Which is Way cool, man. Because first season, really. they didn't have any more of that. Uh, I mean, you know, in the old Star Wars movie, barely could see that stuff in the original. So yeah, and it's great to see that they're using it a lot more now. Hmm. Crazy like he jump out of the ship and just oh, I got my my jetpack and gone. So I guess we're gonna see Ahsoka, Ahsoka on in uh, the next episode. Now I don't know who that is. Who's that? That's uh that was um Anakin's apprentice, Jedi apprentice. Oh, so she's also from the show because I've seen pictures of this this character, right? She's got like yeah. the blue the blue and white like striped yeah. tentacle hair or whatever yeah. that is, right? And with the, like the orange face. Yeah, she pl- she she's gonna be played by Rosario Dawson. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you dropped the spoiler alert. On yeah, that, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> spoiler alert. <laughs> Damn. Well, That's I think cool. I think everyone knew about that before. Before this, this season even started, yeah, right, right, production, right. They knew about the, that. the thing is though, because now you see, this is where this is where they gotta be uh, careful, okay? Because they bring up the Jedi, mm-hmm. right? Don't go on that path to the Anakin <laughs> stuff. I don't want to see it. I don't yeah, want to see it. We don't want to see any Skywalkers. I don't want to hear nothing about no Luke, nothing about no Vader. I don't care. Leave yeah. that stuff alone. It's, just, it's butchered enough already. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. I swear to God, if they put in like a <laughs> some other reference, I would say, <laughs> no, man, no, 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 no. You're good on your own. Did you say Anakin Skywalker? <laughs> oh, my God. I'll probably click off. <laughs> like, I know he didn't just say Anakin. <laughs> Click. <laughs> you turn turn the TV off. Just like, just like, just like I, uh, I just it just Ilba pull it off his coat. I'll be like, you know what? That's enough for me. I'm gone. Don't mention anything about that that family. I don't want to hear the name Skywalker. I hey mean, this that guy look like a. It's just Elba. I'm sorry. It's just Elba look like a like a nightmare in that movie. It look like a child. Why? Nightmare. Why are you bringing this back up? We uh, moved on. That movie sucked, man. That's why. Would you let it go? <laughs> <laughs> you know what you need? You need some plant based beet meat. <laughs> <laughs> it will make you think better. <laughs> <laughs> it will make you stop watching. 
lame. <laughs> Stop watching cat these lame movies. movies. Yeah. But yeah, dope episode though. I give it. I definitely give it like a nine and a half out of ten. Yeah, I give it. It nine. was the pace was serious. It, this yeah. was more like more shoot 'em up kind of feel. You know, right. it's always good to see stormtroopers get their butt kicked. <laughs> also, I'm, I'm so happy for that um, frog couple. Oh, uh, the, the happiest story of 2020, folks. Yeah, right the happiest there. story. That's, Happiest story of the, the way they year ran year. to each other when they saw each other. <laughs> I shed a tear. I shed a tear. Yeah, wow. Wow. This all episode about crying. You crying about this? Crying about them. Crying Damn. about this. Good. <laughs> but yeah, definitely solid episode. Uh, you giving it the same rating too or what? I'm giving it a nine. Nine? All right, mm-hmm. cool. Sweet. So yeah, Mandalorian, keep it up. We, uh, I don't know. We'll probably get to watching the rest of this stuff before we're done with season one yeah. of, of this podcast. So yeah. Hopefully we do. <laughs> yeah, Looking hopefully. forward to it. Mm-hmm. All right. Moving stuff. right along. Yeah. Moving we'll call it then. This episode felt like it went kind of quick. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Now we are down back to another week of <laughs> positive <laughs> chakra. What the hell happened to your voice just now? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you purring? You want to do what that damn man. cat? <laughs> He's a jelly. Jell- He's a damn Jellico! <laughs> Jellico GP! <laughs> Jellico GP! <laughs> Jellico positive! Jellico ca- chakra! We got some good positive, positive chakra, chakra here for you guys, folks. This mm-hmm. one's pretty nice. I got it this week. Here we go. Slow it down. Hell yeah. Slow it down. The most difficult thing is the decision to act, the rest is merely tenacity. Hmm. I say it again. Okay. The most difficult thing in this life is the decision to act. The rest of it is just straight tenacity. Mm. And that's from Amelia Earhart. Okay. Thank you. The first woman to fly around the world, right? I think so. Yeah. Don't grade me here. (laughs) <laughs> so you're telling me my actions of watching cats was my mistake yeah that was a bad decision <laughs> that was a bad decision I don't know why we did that uh, maybe we shouldn't we should be very careful when we will do these I uh, can't believe I just watched <laughs> yeah so yeah positive chocolate folks you, positive keep bringing, you can't be switching and merging segments I'm we, sorry. we've moved on I'm we sorry. call it for a reason damn it <laughs> this cats man this cats movie doesn't mess me you up acted like Angelico caught it out <laughs> 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 alright so uh, yeah I think that was it with the positive chakra mm-hmm. this uh, we're moving yep. on to yell outs G we got any yell outs for this oh. uh... I definitely have some yell outs go ahead take it away happy birthday <laughs> To my mother. Oh man! I love you, mommy. Oh. <laughs> Happy birthday, mommy! Happy birthday, birthday mommy! G. <laughs> Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, mommy! Mama G. <laughs> Happy birthday to me, mommy. Mama G. Me, Madre. <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that was hey, good. That was good, yeah. Yeah, big okay. birthday for her. Happy birthday, oh, yeah. babe. Yep. I mean, happy, happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> I said G, GP. I was mixing it up. Sorry. Happy birthday. <laughs> All right. Uh, happy birthday. Mama. I have another happy birthday. You are full of birthdays every week. Ooh, this is another. This is another. Your family another. got too many birthdays, G. <laughs> happy birthday to my grandma. My mother's oh. mother. Oh, happy wow. birthday. Hey! Yeah. We need a round of applause for that one. That is the mama and mama of the mama. Good job. The mamas. Yeah. Happy yeah, birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> sing it again. You should sing it like a jellico. Oh. <laughs> happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> jellico, happy birthday. <laughs> happy birthday, Grandma. I love you. <coughs> oh, oh, man. All right. Lovely. Yes, yes. Um, that's all for me, sir. Okay. Uh, I don't have really any uh, yellouts this week, other than the fact that next week's episode mm. is gonna be stuffed. Stuffed. Because it's Thanksgiving. Yeah. There's gonna be lots of stuffing, plant-based 
Meat is gonna be on the menu. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. If I'm invited to Thanksgiving dinner, it'd be so nice if you guys could do like plant based stuff, please. <laughs> <laughs> no. Anyway, next week's episode is gonna be our Thanksgiving special. I can't believe we're actually having a special. Um, just like how we did with Halloween and having a good time there. Uh, so yeah, it's gonna be. We're looking to have a lot of voices. It's a lot of people probably gonna be. Yeah. On time. So. Yeah, just like at dinner time on Thanksgiving, there's going to be a lot of people there. We're probably going to end up in a fight and probably going to yeah. talk politics. No, I'm joking. We ain't going to talk no goddamn politics. Who uh, ain't my yeah. chicken leg? <coughs> going to be a lot of that. Oh, they going to be chicken at the menu? Oh, okay, nice. This is going to be nice already. I'm hungry mm-hmm. already. Yeah. So, yeah, tune in for that. It's going to be fun. Uh, thank you guys for listening, actually, because we're up to episode 18. It's going to be 19 next week. Ooh. Cannot believe. So, yell out to our fans. Yeah. yeah that's what I got. Yeah, yeah I got to yell out. Yeah, two yell outs. Right. Shout out to yell y'all. Out. The yell people. out to y'all. The, the people. people. The people. The people. The people. The people. <laughs> Listening the people. to the podcast. Batman. <laughs> it's not here. <laughs> it is... Of course it is a plan. <laughs> we give it to you. On the contrary. The Bye. people. The people. <laughs> we're breaking off. We're breaking off. We're losing it, Rob. Yeah, we're losing. We're losing it, yeah. <laughs> if we need to eat some of this plant-based stuff, please, hurry Come up. Come on. All right. So, yeah, tune into that. Thank you, guys. Yell out all around. That was that man known as Jellico GP. <laughs> <laughs> and that was that cat man known as Jellico AD. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> I'm singing! <laughs> I'm on the podcast and I'm singing! <laughs> <laughs> And we, that is what we do here, folks. <laughs> and now we have to pay some cats to stop pooing on our <laughs> TV sets. Yes. <laughs> so we will hopefully have the PS5 soon. But if not, we will still catch you guys here next week. <laughs> Eventually. Yeah. Peace. It is his, man. <laughs> <laughs> Jellica.